Hi, in this video, I'm going to give you some tips in working with the progress bar component inside of Create Studio. So the progress bar is a component that you can find over here, above C, and these are great for adding onto social media posts or video ads. You can simply drag it onto your canvas and hit spacebar to preview. And you'll be able to see when I added the progress bar, it, it automatically resized to the length of the media on the timeline. Okay, you can also go ahead and manually resize it. And we've got a whole bunch of settings over here. You can also make adjustments to the size on the actual canvas. So you can bring it up, you can resize it like so. Uh, or you can just go ahead and position it like this. Okay, so we've got a progress bar. Might make it slightly less high like that. And what we can do is also choose different preset designs. So we've got a whole bunch of pre-styled elements you can choose. And you can make adjustments to the actual design by simply coming over here to background. You could, for example, make it black or bring down the opacity. You can also adjust the color of the time bar like this. And you can adjust the border radius around the corners and you can also adjust this setting here 100% at. So let's say for example you want the progress bar to be 100% across at 10 seconds. What you could do is bring it up and let's say at 50% of the time bar we can hit enter it's going to reach 100%. And now you're about to see as it plays through about 50% it's already reached its full limit okay. So that you can use this in different types of situations with your videos. Um, but yeah, most of the time you probably just want this to be 100% and you have to have your progress bar end when your video ends like that. So that's just some quick tips in working with the progress bar inside of Create Studio.